everyone! Today let's play Minecraft with Daddy and my friends Spongebob and Squidward. Hello, friends. Hey! Thanks, Peppa, for inviting me. It's so great to play with you. So excited to join together? I hope I'm having some fun. Of course you'll have fun. You're playing with Peppy after all. <laughs> Guys, let's get a lot of emotions together, shall we? Obviously, Squidward is always like that. You can ignore it. He really wants to play, otherwise he wouldn't be here. Alright, let's make a world. So, uh, difficulty normal, game mode survival, everything's fine. Oh yeah, I'm in the world, how are you doing? I'm here too. It feels wonderful. Peppa, I'm here. It's great to be playing Minecraft again. Oh, yeah. Peppa, how do you spend your time with your family? Oh, we are having an amazing time. We recently went to the beach and tried out all kinds of water sports. Yes, it was great. I even tried surfing and watched Peppa and George try to conquer the huge waves a few times. Haha, <laughs> the waves weren't as huge as you say. SpongeBob, what's your favorite place? My favorite place is the deep sea. Or I meet amazing sea creatures and explore the underwater world. Squidward, what about you? I'll tell you what. I love my quiet weekends. I just sit on the couch, watch my favorite show, and do nothing. Oh, Squidward, you are always such a fan of television. But you know, traveling and exploring is so exciting. I would always choose active and interesting adventures. What about your job, Squidward? What's it like working in a restaurant? Working in a restaurant always leaves me exhausted. But as a cashier, I watch all the customers and can see their happy faces as they enjoy the disgusting SpongeBob food. You realize how little it takes for the pathetic creatures. That's why I'm so good at the Krusty Krabs cookbook program. I'm always ready to cook the most delicious crab burgers for visitors. It's so great that we have different interests and goals in life. This makes our communication so interesting and enjoyable. Absolutely! After all, we're always excited to share new adventures and learn about each other. How was everyone's week? Oh, I had a very busy week at work. But at the end of all those classes, I was so hungry I could have eaten a whole giant sandwich. And I had a fantastic week on Krusty Krab. I invented a new dish, a hamburger with avocado and sea sponges. All the guests loved it. Well, what an interesting week you've had. I, by the way, have been in my personal paradise, which I call home. To be left all alone to enjoy my music and not hear any fun. Why so pessimistic, Squidward? There is always room for fun and joy in life. That's right, Peppa. We must find a little joy everywhere, even in the most ordinary things. For example, just look at Squidward. He wrinkles his eight-armed tentacles in such a funny way. Funny? I appreciate peace and quiet much more. But Squidward, without fun, life would be so boring. What fun is life if you're always serious and angry? That's right. Fun moments make our lives bright and memorable. Let's have a great time playing together. I've known Squidward for a long time, and I can say with confidence that fun is just what it looks like to him, a boring time in the house. Yeah, yeah. Today at school we learned how to draw castles. Do you like drawing? Oh yes, art is my calling. I'm great at drawing peanut butter. Oh my god, it's not even art. Drawing peanut butter is stupid. What do you like to do besides drawing, Squidward? I love playing the clarinet and painting pictures. It's real art. Oh, how interesting. Will you show us your painting, Squidward? Someday, maybe. Do any of you like music? I love listening to music and singing songs. I even have a band in the seaside neighborhood of Bikini Bottom. Who asked you, SpongeBob? Unbelievable, what a great job you guys are doing. I like to dance to my favorite music. Wow, we have so many favorite hobbies. We are so different, but we always find common ground. And most importantly, let's not forget to have fun and enjoy the game of Minecraft. I agree, SpongeBob. Let's always do what we love and share it with others. SpongeBob, how do you spend your free time? I love making crab burgers in my free time. I had lessons at school today. We studied math and read an interesting adventure book. I thought back to my high school days in Bikini Bottom. Oh, I loved school. School? I have nothing to remember. It was a total failure. No teacher understood my talented nature and great art. I always sat and drew in my notebook. Daddy, how did you spend your last day of school? My last day of school was unbelievable. We went on a field trip to the local zoo as a whole class. To the zoo? That's so cool! Tell me, what did you see? We saw so many interesting animals. Wolves, lions, elephants, and even a giraffe. But the most exciting part was feeding the penguins. They are so funny and curious. SpongeBob, can you add something about the school? I recently finished my cooking classes at the Maritime School. Really, SpongeBob? Are you serious about becoming a chef? Absolutely, Squidward. I was inspired by the seafood in new recipes. 
Now I dream of opening my own restaurant underwater. SpongeBob, that sounds amazing. I'll probably visit your restaurant when it opens. Me too, I really love seafood. Well, good luck to you, SpongeBob. Though I doubt you'll be able to create anything memorable. Absolutely, Squidward. I was inspired by the seafood in new recipes. Now I dream of opening my own restaurant underwater. <laughs> SpongeBob, how's it going at Bikini Bottom? Peppa! Everything is great as always. We are laughing, making crappers, and spending time with friends. How are you? We're doing well, too. That's good to hear. All right, guys. It's time to share what we've all accomplished while playing Minecraft. I found a village. I made a lot of bread out of hay. Now I'm thinking about finding a place for my house. Wow, I'm not doing so well. I didn't find much food. Only watermelons in the jungle, and I'm out. I'm thinking of building a house in the jungle. I don't want an ordinary one. I'll make something interesting out of bamboo. There's a lot of bamboo here. I'm in a cave right now, smelting iron I mined. I'll be here for a while. I want to make myself some iron armor. I don't feel comfortable without an armor. I found a remote village. There are a lot of cats. There's an iron golem and a lot of villagers. I'll build somewhere here. Wow, what I found, some kind of ruined portal. There's a chest in here. The forest is on fire. Golden leggings with enchantment protection 3 and a golden hoe with enchantment mending. You got a great gold leggings. They will protect you well with such an enchanted. Not for long as it is gold, it is fragile. But the hoe is of course useless. It's time for me to go upstairs and build a house. I need to protect all the items I've gotten and crafted. Oh, sweet home. You'll be a cozy place where I can do whatever I want in peace. Paint pictures, play instruments. I'm starting to build my cabin too. I don't need a big house. I'm going to make a small one so I have enough space. Very intriguing how the bamboo house will turn out and what it will look like. Of course, I've already visualized it in my head, but how it will be in reality. So far, it doesn't look ordinary. I found a great spot by the river. I think this would be a good place for a house. I don't want to get too fancy. I'll start by building a simple house out of wood. For the first time, SpongeBob, you said the right thing. The first house should be built as it comes. After all, there are not yet many beautiful stones to be found in the mine. I would build a work of art out of the stones. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and like. Don't forget to write a funny comment. Bye, everybody. I hope you had an enjoyable time watching us play Minecraft and discussing different topics. Bye, everyone. Bye, bye. Keep an eye out for the next videos. There are many more awesome videos waiting for you. Goodbye.